And new at 7 o'clock, a mystery disease ravaging the willow trees in the Elfin Forest. They're dying off at an alarming rate, and scientists have no idea why. 10 News reporter Vanessa Van Hefty went into the North County Forest with the conservation experts who are racing to find an answer. This is the area here in Elfin Forest that scientists call ground zero. You can see here everything has mysteriously died. The leaves are all black. So these are the, like the dying shoots. Scientists are searching for clues to find a silent killer in Elfin Forest. It's a deadly mystery no one has been able to solve. These giant willows are rapidly dwindling in Elfin Forest, and no one knows why. Leonard Whitworth with the Escondido Creek Conservancy says it started in the spring. It um, started out with just a few trees, and at the sort of the peak infestation, it was probably three or four acres. Giant mounds of dead stumps and branches clogged the creek bed, where there are no signs of life. It's disconcerting, to say the least. At first, scientists from UC Riverside thought it was the shot hole borer beetle, known to attack willows by the hundreds of thousands in Southern California. But tests shot that theory down. Now they're bagging more evidence, trying to find the culprit. They believe it's some type of fungus. I don't see any insect activity. The willow death has a ripple effect, hurting endangered songbirds and other wildlife, and all these standing trees are a feeding ground for potential wildfires. They've closed trails and are warning people not to take the wood until they know what's on it. If you burn firewood, you know, try to keep it as local as possible. Scientists hope to get some answers. Those new test results should be back in in 7 to 10 days. In Elfin Forest, Vanessa Van Hefty, 10 News.